I find the course useful because it gives me an idea of how I can bring science into the classroom and use different experiments in W5 in with the students in the classroom with the resources that everyday teachers would have access to. Just to reiterate, like reiterate what Gemma said there, it was great having a really practical module um, where you got experience of organising a school trip and taking them out to W5 and being in charge of the class while they were out there and then doing all the follow-up work and it was also nice getting to see your peers teaching as well which you never ever get a chance to do. Um, I thought that this course really helps you understand the importance of planning before you go to a science centre like W5 because the children need to appreciate what they're going there for, they need to know, they need to be able to place all the exhibits in a context so if they hadn't known anything about forces before they went out they would have thought everything was just a game and you really needed to focus their learning towards the exhibits and they needed to see how it related to what they were learning in the curriculum. And you kind of find as well that they went to the resource or they went to the exhibits that were about forces and things that they had been learning about because then they were able to use their knowledge. Yeah. And, yeah. yeah and it was nice after W5 then to come back and to see that they had remembered information from even lessons before W5 and then also the stuff and that learned. Yeah. 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 As regards like assessing it, like as tutors and stuff, like you can see so much more from a section of clips than you can from a written down piece of you know, paper with your lesson plan, you can see more in a video. And the video, the way we've done it, the way it progresses from the first lesson right up to the last lesson, it's nice to see the full progression of the five weeks, you know, through it all and how yeah, how the topics have changed and how the children are remembering things. Well, like your your lessons having four individual lessons, um it can be quite disjointed and even putting it into a scheme is quite disjointed so when you come to do, to do your video paper it's good in a way that it, you can see a logical progression through the whole sort of set of lessons um, I think that's quite good about it um, but the idea is really strong the headmaster of our school wanted to do it he wanted to get he some wanted sort a copy. of video yeah. paper yeah. and he, he was interested in doing a, you know, for, like a project for the school to do yeah. as well I think it's a good idea oh definitely it is a really good idea I think the best part of the, the module for me was like, it was completely different than any other module I'd done. There was like, um, sort of out, outside your comfort zone, teaching with other people and being video recorded, but What's once you got into it, it was actually really, really good. And yeah, in the last one you didn't even notice, that's the thing, I was the first one up and at the start I was terrified, but you see once you get into the web it, you don't even realise people are there and there's a camera on you. This is probably one of the modules I think. Well, myself, I know I've got the most out of. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. definitely. And you remember the most and you know that you'll use it when you are. It's practical though. Whereas